Good morning, friends. So in this particular video, what we are going to discuss is another part of perceptron tutorial that is a solved example of uh, using basically perceptron, right? So basically the question uh, for us that we need to solve using perceptron is we are trying to implement and function using perceptron network for bipolar inputs and targets. So first of all, we have to know what bipolar inputs and bipolar targets. Uh, basically, these are nothing else uh, we have instead of using zero now we are using minus one so we will have only two uh, types of inputs that will be plus one or minus one in that case so if you have and gate and you are replacing all zeros with minus one you will have inputs for bipolars okay one is as usual one but my zero is basically replaced with minus one here okay what else we are doing is we are initially making the value of w1 w2 bias is zero as well as the learning rate of alpha is set to one okay the pictorial representation of perceptron is like this one we have input like x1 here x2 here and we are applying weight w1 and w2 with these inputs then we have one another input that is bias its value is one here okay so definitely whenever we get some output over here that is calculated by using x1 into w1 plus x2 into w2 plus by one into bias value okay so that is basically the net input that we calculate till this line and then we apply activation function on that one to get the result of this specific y or that we are basically saying output of this perceptron right so we will apply the same formula we will first calculate the net input that will be used by using b plus x1 w1 plus x2 w2 and when we will replace the value of these bias is initially zero x1 is one w1 is zero x2 is one and w2 is zero so after calculating this equation we will get zero as output so the net input for us right now if uh, using the values uh, of uh, x1 1 and x2 2 sorry x2 1 in that case the net input that we are calculating is zero the next step that we have to do is we have to apply this net input to an activation function and this is basically the activation function that we are going to apply with that one and because the uh, value of this net input is zero we are getting this output that is zero again so the output for specific inputs one and one for x1 x2 and the bias zero we are getting output zero if we will compare this output with target our target is one and the output that we are getting from this particular equation is zero so both are not equal that we are that means we are not achieving our target and basically our role is or our basic aim is to achieve the target okay so if we are not achieving the target what we should do we will basically update these weights the w1 w2 and bias these are the specific weights and we need to change them or we need to update them how we are going to update it for that we are having this specific formula wi of new is equals to wi of old plus alpha txi this alpha txi is basically called the delta rule okay we are going to minimize the errors basically so we have this value already we have calculated wi old or uh, we assumed wi old initially that was zero in that in this case for w1 w2 and bias alpha we said that it is uh, one that we have already set it t is the target value that is one okay x1 and x2 will be replaced with the value of x1 and x2 so for this specific w1 new we will replace it with zero the original value of old w1 plus alpha that is one into target that is one and x1 that is one so we will get one in this case same for w2 we will get one and for bias we will get b old plus alpha t b old was one alpha is one target is one so one into one is one in that case so the new values of all weights for w1 for w2 and bias is one okay now what we will do 
ठीक है टिल येट व्हाट वी हैव डन इज वी हैव कैलकुलेटेड द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई इन एस पर दिस डायग्राम वी हैव कैलकुलेटेड द वैल्यू ऑफ नेट इनपुट दैट इज कमिंग टू दिस सेक्शन एंड देन वी विल अप वी हैव अप्लाइड एन एक्टिवेशन फंक्शन एंड वी हैव अचीव्ड अ रिजल्ट दैट इज जीरो इन दैट केस वी हैव कंपेयर्ड द रिजल्ट ऑफ वाई विद द टारगेट वैल्यू this one and they both are not same if they both are not same we have to update the rules sorry the weights of for x1 and x2 and bias for all these okay we have to update this but if y is equal to target then we don't need to change uh, the specific values of w and w2 and b okay so we have changed it and what we are doing we have achieved the new weights at w1 is equals to 1 w2 equals to 1 and b is equals to 1 and then again we will apply the same rule means x1 into w1 plus x2 into w2 plus 1 into b okay again we will have the same thing we will calculate net input we will get output by using activation function over net input and we will compare it with another value of this okay in second case our x1 will be this x2 will be this and target will be this in third case x1 will be this x2 will be this and target will be this and every time we will keep updating the values of w1 w2 and bias okay same thing we will do and when we are going to stop is when all targets become equal to the calculated output or we will get a separating line that obtain using the final weight for separating the positive response from negative response if any of these two is achieved we can stop our algorithm Okay, so if we see the output at the very first epoch, what we have achieved, the blue x1 was one, x2 was one, and uh, bias was one, target is one. Okay, in that case, we have achieved the net input as one, and uh, after applying activation function, our output was one. If we compare this with this, they both are not equal. We have used or we have updated the weights. Okay, and in this case, you can see we are not updating the weights. right so in second epoch what you are seeing almost the calculated output and our target values are same so after this epoch we can say that we have achieved our target our uh, basic aim of calculating the perceptron value so we can stop the algorithm over here so guys i hope you understand the concept of perceptron for applying and function i uh, recommend that you should apply the same with other or not and and so on and you just try that up if you have any problems or if you have any comments please mention it in comment section and please like it for uh, more videos like this thank you very much